So Sonic is pretty interesting because he almost he doesn't really function the same way as he did in Smash 4. Uh, he's 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 more aggressive and you spin dash a lot more in this iteration of um Sonic compared to the previous iterations of Sonic. Um, but right now we're gonna start off on PS2, the quote unquote best neutral stage. Um, yeah, and Sifferling up to you know a, a faster start. You know, just getting some of these spin dash punishes. Um, when YGK is whiffing a lot of aerials in front of Sonic Shield, looks like looks like he's not really spacing these aerials correctly, and he's getting he's getting stuffed out a lot by Sonic. Like Sonic just seems like Sifferling's throwing out preemptive aerials. Um, when YGK wants to throw something out. Yeah, right now, um, it's, this looks like they're still kind of feeling each other out. It seems like a lot of choppy, choppy movement, not really any consistent strings or whatnot. A lot of spot dodges. I think Cipher Wing spot dodges about four times in that sequence just now. Okay, he yeah, has to punish. Can't shadow sneak um, off the, in the middle of the stage like that. So, I mean, still pretty much even game. Right now, Sonic is in kill percent for a down tilt to up smash. So, let's see if um, YHK can confirm that. But right now, YHK is off stage, and you can get, you still get forward smash, two frame forward smash by Sonic. That never changed. Um, but right now, Cipherwing have, have Y2K at the edge of the stage, up throw. Okay, trying to get a follow up. Yeah. And he's really fishing for that forward smash. He's really fishing for these forward smashes and smash attacks. Just trying to end the stock. And he got that whiff punish. Yeah. Like I was saying, YJK has been whiffing a lot in front of Cipherwing's shield. And Cipherwing has been going for these hard punishes. And he's not too shy about throwing out these smash attacks. And he got that first stock. Okay. Ooh. And that and that homing attack. Track Greninja all the way down there. And he still had enough jumps to get back to the stage. Okay, early recovery by YJK, not wanting to get clipped down low by Cipherwing. Okay. Yeah, and, and this... Ooh, okay, SD. Okay, that was odd SD. I was just about to say that Cipherwing was... He's moving very well around Y2K's buttons, and uh, he's using a lot of neutral air and the neutral B to punish some of Y2K's uh, options. It seems like YJK needs to clean up the spacing a little bit to try to really put some pressure on Cipherwing. Because there's been a lot of inconsistent pressure by Y2K thus, uh, thus far. But with that being said, uh, catches Cipherwing's landing with the forward smash. Ooh, and tries to catch the, air, the directional air dodge with the forward smash and just whiffs ever slightly. It just seems like he's just always slightly off with some of these punishes. Okay. Yeah, right now Cipherwing. Yeah, now these forward smashes are going to start to come out by Cipherwing. Yeah, and YGK needs to watch how he's coming down in, in front of Cipherwing. Because Cipherwing definitely looks like he's eager to punish whatever YGK is throwing out in front of him really hard. And uh, YGK needs to be wary of that. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like YGK is just like whiffing a lot of attacks in front of Cipherwing. And... But let's see if he can capitalize in this situation. Ooh, okay. Okay, and that was a good back air, uh, landing back air by Cipherwing, trying uh, stuffing out Y2K's uh, attempted anti-air. Ooh, and it looked like he tried to read the down air with the counter, um, but he did read that, did read that landing on this onto the platform and punched it with an up smash. Ooh, okay. Yeah, Cipherwing is really eager for these forward smash punishes. Looks like he really wants to call out <laughs> all these um, attacks that are whiffing in front of his face with the forward smash. Um, with that being said, uh, YHK stacking on a quick 65%. Cipherwing trying to fight his way back on the stage, and YHK is not letting him do that. Okay, high recovery by Cipherwing. Just trying to get out of the situation. Ooh, okay. Yeah, those four smashes are definitely going to come out. It just seems like... Ooh. Wow. So... So yeah, oh, so he definitely caught that backer with the forward smash, and um, that was something that he was getting caught by consistently throughout the set, I mean, throughout the first match, and uh, near the end he finally called it, called it out. Yeah, look at that, look at that spacing. You know, I was talking about his spacing earlier in the game, how it wasn't that um, good, but it seems like once he's getting into the flow of the game a little bit better, that uh, his spacing also 
has gotten progressively better. And um, one of the shining spots they did do was the anti errors. Um, when Sephiroth was trying to come down with some of these aerials, and you know, it goes to show how he took that last dock. But um, with that being said, you know, let's see what they're gonna do. They're gonna go run it right back. Um, you know, I agree. I mean, um, Sephiroth Wing was really pretty much in control of that whole game until that last sequence where he kept holding forward and Y2K kind of just punished everything. So, yeah, I mean, let's see what happens in this game too. Yeah, and, and right off the bat, YJK is just starting off with the up tilt, you know, stuffing Sonic's landing. But another forward smash coming up by Cipherwing. Wanted to call out all of these descending arrows with the forward smash. Seems like his favorite move to try to whiff punish with. Okay. YJK having Cipherwing at the ledge. Okay, down tilt, forwarder. Ooh. Looks like a miss input though. Okay. Yeah, and great tech chase with the spin dash. That spin dash looked like he did about 40 something percent. <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, up there. See what he does. Yeah, and Sephiroth always immediately um, springing out of that, out of those up throws. He doesn't want to deal with any type of follow up or mix up coming from YJK. And one thing he's also doing, he's re always recovering high. Like, he doesn't want to deal with any. I don't think he wants to deal with anything right now. Yeah, he's always he's always springing out of disadvantage when he gets up thrown. But YJK catching that last landing with the forward air and you know 92% get punished with a forward smash. And the Cipher wing, it seems like the Cipher wing special is a forward smash. He like he loves punishing a lot of these moves with forward smash. I mean it does have a lot of range. Um, so you know you can't really blame him. Probably one of the best range moves that Sonic has in his arsenal, so that's up to him. But right now, YGK, you know, off to a fast lead on the second stock. At 93%, got the Phantom Footstool. Doesn't matter, got the up throw up air from Cipherwing. Quick 16%. Ooh, near forward smash. That wasn't true. It looks like um, YGK fumbled a little bit. And I'm not sure if some of these um, counters are mis inputs or he's trying to read. Maybe a spin dash coming from Sephiroth, or maybe a forward smash that Sephiroth likes to throw out in front of Y2K's uh, face sometimes. Maybe try to hard call that out. Okay, right now, um, Y2K finally getting that counter that he wanted, um, punishing that second nair that Sephiroth tried to drop on his shield with the counter, and Greninja's counter is beefy, so. Yeah, he's charging that forward smash. Sifwing definitely wants to get that kill with that forward smash. 100%. Ooh, but instead he gets the nair to back air. Um, 120% doesn't die. Okay, you know, trigger recovery by um, Y2K. Yeah. Okay, c catching Y2K is recovering, throwing him back off stage. Let's see how the edge guard is. Okay, try to catch him with a spring, couldn't reach. And he wants that forward smash. And he spot every time he throws out that forward smash, he's gonna spot dodge to cover himself. Okay, try to get the nair to back here. Too high of a percent though, so it's not gonna work out. Ooh, forward throw. And yeah, he DI'd that very well. Looked like it he, he didn't DI it well at first, okay. Yeah, and that spring got him lower to the blast zone, so. Good stuff by Cipher Wing. Now pretty much even percents. Okay. Anti-airing with that up tilt. That up tilt is so good. It's just a really good dish drain by Greninja. Okay. And getting, trying to, and getting out of disadvantage is Sifling with that um, neutral view. Okay, and yeah, he's doing some of these counters. I have to think that those are his inputs. And another, another landing punish with forward smash coming from Y2K. Um, that's one of the things he's really consistent with consistent with in this set was the way he was punishing um, the way he was anti-airing Cipherwing. If it was was if it wasn't with the forward smash, it was with an up tilt. So I mean that's good stuff by um, Y2K. Maybe you know clean it up a little bit when it comes down later rounds, but good stuff, man. Good stuff by both players, man.